hello guys i hope you are doing really really well in today's video i will show you different tips and tricks related to samsung internet so guys samsung internet is really powerful browser and it has really useful features so first feature is related uh, to blocking the ads so for example i open this website and there are some ads playing on the uh, website so if you want to block these ads what you can do is you just go over here you see these three lines so just select it and once you select it you will see the option of add blockers okay so just select it and once you select it you will see the option add block for samsung internet so i enable it so once you enable it now i open this website again okay i open it and then you can see there will be no ad over here in this uh, website so this is how you can block your ads into uh, for your website so this is the first tip so guys the next tip is related uh, to using your samsung internet privately uh, and if you don't want to uh, save the history or you don't want to save the cookies of your website so you can use the secret mode option of uh, samsung internet so how to access it you see this option over here related to the tabs okay so just select it and once you select it you will see the option of turn on secret mode so once you select it okay so here you can enter your password uh, okay so uh, you can set your password okay so for example i just uh, write this password i press ok so now you can see i can open a new tab over here so guys if you see uh, this goggles uh, like icon over here it means uh, you are using the secret mode uh, of your samsung internet so here you can access uh, uh, all your websites okay now for example uh, by chance you just uh, finish your work and you don't close your website properly you just press the home screen button okay and now someone want to access uh, your um, tablet or your phone okay so if he want to use this a recent button option and then he try to open the uh, secret mode of the website so for example he will click this one so it will not directly open the website for him he has to put the password for it to access it okay so otherwise what he can do is he has no option he just have to turn off uh, the secret mode and then will it will open to the normal mode of the uh, screen so for example i select this and then it will open the normal uh, website so he cannot no one can access uh, your secret mode of websites um, because uh, it needs the password okay so how to access different settings related to the secret mode you have to go over here these three lines okay just go to the settings once you enter into the settings you will see an option of personal browsing data so just select it and here uh, you have all the option for example uh, you want to change the secret mode settings just select it and here you can change the password okay you can see the change password option so you have to verify it uh, or if you don't want to use password again it will ask you so you can disable it if you don't want if you want to use your face for your biometrics you can also use your face option in the secret mode so you can do a lot in the secret mode it is really really uh, useful and protected the second tip is related to go to upward and go to downward button so for example i am scrolling it down you can see there are two buttons showing over here in the middle so for example i just press this down button okay so it will bring me to the bottom of my website okay and then for example if i scroll upward and you see this upward button and then i press it it will bring me uh, to the beginning of uh, my website so how to enable these buttons so just select these three lines over here again okay then select the settings option okay and once you select it you will see an option of web page view and scrolling so just select it and once you select it you will see this option of show go to top button just if it is disabled just enable it and select this show go to bottom button you have to enable this one as well okay then you will see this option uh, the third option over here is related to scroll bar so guys scroll bar is over here i will show you so for example if you scrolling it down you see there is a scroll bar is going over here so you can use this one as well okay so for example if you want to move down faster okay so you can see 
you can just use this option as well so scroll ball you can make it to the left or you can make it to the right side as well so again go to the settings okay and then you see this web page view and scrolling and scroll bar left right and also you can hide it if you don't want to use it the next tip is related to using of your website uh, as an app so guys some websites they don't have the app but you are using them quite frequently and you want to access them always so how to use the website as an app so for example like this website i want to use this as an app so i just go over here these uh, lines and then i will select this option of add page to so i just select it and once you select it you will see the option of home screen so just select it and once you select it you can give it any name and then press add so then it will add to your home screen so if you want to access it okay it will show you over here so for example uh, like this website is become like an app for you so you can see there are different apps and this website is also uh, working as an app so if you just click it it will open the website for you straight away and then you can access it the next option is related to the full mode of the website okay to hide the status bar so how you can hide it just select this uh, three lines select the settings okay and then you see the option of layout and menu so just select it and then here you see the hide status bar option just enable it okay so you can see it will disappear and if you disable it it will appear again so you just enable it to have the full mode view and then here for tab and address bar layout you can make them together so these uh, tab will go with the uh, address bar so like that so you can see the address bar is also there and the tabs are also there so you will have full mode of the website so guys the next tip is related uh, to the translation of different website into different languages so what you can do is you just go over here again these uh, uh, three lines just select it and then you see this translator option over here so just select it so once you select it you can see you can uh, change the setting so I change it for example translate page to Chinese so for example I select it and then you see it will translate the page for me into another language language so I change this English into Chinese so you can see over here okay so you can see and then if you want to go back to the original language go to the translator again and select the show page in original language okay so this is how you can use this option uh, the other option is for example uh, you want to uh, use uh, this uh, bar for the URL you can just press and hold the home button okay and then simply you can type any website from here directly you don't have to uh, uh, tap here and then type so it will be easy for you uh, the next tip is related to adding a new tab so you can add new tab by using this plus sign okay or what you can do is the tabs are over here as you can see it is showing the seven tabs are open so i just select it and then you see the option of new tab so you can also add a new tab from here uh, to open a new website so this is how you can use this option as well uh, so guys this is for today's video i hope you like the video i hope you enjoy the video so please do subscribe to my channel guys thank you very much